This video is brought to you by YT Andrew Paul Tech Repairs. If you have a console, laptop, computer or Macbook in need of repair in the UK or the EU then have a look in the description below this video for details on how to contact us in order to organise your repair. Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen and welcome to this video and this is outside our usual schedule of programming uh, to bring you some news and indeed this is something that I've been working on for a long time and I haven't yet shown to the world until now and I've had a big influx of subscribers overnight uh, following on from my mate Vince's latest episode of his Fixers series where I appeared in series 1 episode 8 which I think is the final episode of that series but I've watched them all and it's a brilliant piece of video and a really entertaining watch so I'd encourage anybody who hasn't checked them out to go to his channel my mate Vince and just go and have a look and see what everybody else in the repair space on YouTube is up to because there's some absolutely fascinating projects some brilliant fixers and some really talented people out there and it was an absolute honor and a privilege to be a part of that and once again Vince if you're watching this mate thank you very much for that opportunity so on to what we're here for today and why I think a lot of uh, the new subscribers will be here and that is indeed for the thing that you see on screen in front of you right now so this is what I call the HDMI patch initially available for the PS4 uh, original models with the SAA and SAB001 motherboards it's compatible with all those variety of motherboards and can be quickly and easily installed in scenarios where you have missing pins from the HDMI header so the bits that you solder the legs of the HDMI port to if those are ripped out then this can go in and repair that damage quite easily so the idea is the little copper pads you see around the board solder onto the various bits and pieces of the circuit to rebuild it so once those pads are missing whereas before traditionally you would have had to have gone in there with a length of copper wire you don't have to do that anymore you can just pop this on put it into position and then resolder it for those of you who want to see it in action i will have a more detailed installation video uh, up very shortly i'm hoping for the weekend uh, in the meantime if you check the description of this video i will pop a link to my mate vince's uh, latest episode of the fixer series one episode eight we're the first up and you'll be able to see a really quick overview basically of how this thing is installed into your ps4 and uh, ultimately in the end uh, it works very nicely and you know it, it restores full hdmi output at 1080p 60 hertz uh, absolutely beautifully um, so i've been using this and testing it in the field now for around 12 months uh, personally and it's been excellent the reliability has been first class so i am now more than confident to offer these out to everybody and that's what i'm doing today so price wise initially i wasn't sure what to put these up at and this could change going forwards Initially, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them out there for $5.99, which will include free shipping to a UK mainland address. For shipment overseas, obviously the shipping charges are going to vary slightly, but having checked the Royal Mail website, which is the main mail carrier here in the UK, it's not too expensive to get them sent out anywhere really. So if you're abroad, then it's probably going to be a, an extra couple of British pounds, but nothing too incredible uh if you obviously have a business and you want to order large quantities then obviously i'm happy to discuss that and we can discuss discounts for multiple units so absolutely that's a conversation i'm more than happy to uh, to have but not having anything like this around uh, having anything else to compare it against it just seemed like um, a fair shout considering what they cost per unit for me to make them so uh, yeah, hopefully that's going to be okay and agreeable with you all. But for a starting point, I thought that was probably pretty fair enough. So my website is www.ytandrewpaul.co.uk. That will be going live very shortly. Um, I don't know if it'll go up today or if it'll go up by the end of the week. Um, essentially, everything's ready and raring to go. I just need to test the payment gateways to make sure all that's working. 
And providing it is, then I'm happy to throw the doors open, uh, you know, on that for you to order these things at your leisure, uh, in accordance with a couple of other bits and pieces I've got up there. Um, in the meantime, if you want to order some of these, uh, and of course the website isn't live yet, then feel free to do what I usually ask you to do, and that is to drop me an email, which again is in the description of this video. It's ytandrewpaul at outlook.com. Uh, again, with what you'd like, and I'll see if I can furnish that for you. I do have a small initial stock of these ready and raring to go. Uh, I think this small order I have here is around 80 patches. So uh, don't worry if you miss them, because I will be getting some more uh, ordered up. And th the lead time on them is fairly short, so um, once these are out of stock, more will be coming in. And for those of you wondering, um, this is the first project of a few I have lined up. Um, I have a few more ideas uh, for similar items, which will make uh, repairing really badly damaged console motherboards hopefully a lot easier in future going forwards. Um, so watch this space. Uh, these HDMI patch uh, ideas I have in the works currently... Uh, some for the Xbox One, uh, Xbox One S, uh, Series S, Series X, uh, PS4, PS4 1200, uh, PS4 Slim, PS4 Pro, uh, PS5. And I'm also in the process of getting these together for the Nintendo Switch and the Switch Lite. So for those of you who have missing internal rows of pins and things like that, then I have a solution for you, which I'm currently working on. And hopefully, in the not too distant future, that will be available for you to purchase as well. And that should hopefully banish any of these switches which have been completely butchered. Uh, hopefully, you'll be able to drag them back out of the cupboard and breathe some life into them once again. So, as I say, this is outside of our scheduled programming. So, our typical video, Wednesday 6pm, will still be going live. And uh, in the meantime, as I say, keep an eye on the website for that going up. And in the meantime, if you really want some of these, we can ship them worldwide. Um, so, as I say, just drop me an email at whiteyandrewpaulatoutlook.com with your quantities. And I can arrange to get these sent out to you as soon as is possible. And, um, you know, so I, you can pay by PayPal, bank transfer, via email. The website obviously will have credit, debit card payments uh, and all that sort of stuff set up on there. And like I say, I'm hoping if that's not live tonight, just depends when I can get to test the payment gateways. If not by tonight, then hopefully by the weekend. They seem to be working perfectly fine in Devon Test. Obviously, working in IT myself, I know thoroughly well that something can work really nicely in Dev. You throw it live, and then all of a sudden you find something that doesn't work quite right. So obviously I don't want that to happen. So I just want to make sure that these are thoroughly tested before I open the doors uh, to you all and these patches are ready and raring to go they're just waiting for you to uh, get in touch so i thank you for watching ladies and gentlemen uh hopefully you've found this useful if you have then feel free to smash that like button if you know of anybody who you think would benefit from this little item anybody you think um would be interested then i obviously would implore you to uh to share this uh, idea with them and point them in my direction if you own a repair shop, as I say, I am more than happy to discuss large quantities with you. Uh, bulk discounts, things like that, feel free to drop me an email if you're in that position. And I am more than happy, as I say, to discuss um, bespoke orders and things like that. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you a little bit later on. Thank you very much once again. Thank you to Vince for doing a fantastic job of showcasing this last night for me. And I will see you, hopefully, on the 6pm slot Wednesday. So, for me, for now, it's bye-bye. Hope life treats you well. Stay safe out there. And I look forward to hearing from you shortly. Many thanks for watching then, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you have, then why not check out these recommendations below. Also, please remember to comment, rate, and, of course, subscribe to the channel if you found this useful. We've plenty more content on there, and there's lots more to come.